How you guys doing? Today we're checking out the Air Jordan 1 High OG Rookie of the Year. Inspired by Jordan's Rookie of the Year campaign, this shoe hits a level of timelessness that no other sneaker has before. The Golden Harvest color theme is inspired by the shirt Jordan wore to his acceptance ceremony in 1985. As soon as I picked up the shoe, one of the key details I noticed were the detachable ankle collar flaps. Both bear messages for any dedicated Jordan fan or anyone that appreciates the details put into a sneaker. One side is a direct quote from his acceptance speech. This award is nice, but I just feel it's very important for each individual to go out and contribute to his team. The other will be his statistics from his Rookie of the Year campaign. A combination of the tumbled leather and the suede really establishes this shoe as a vintage sneaker. I think it contrasts very well and the materials really bring the shoe out. Other little details I noticed about the sneaker right away were the red tongue tag and the splashes of black in the laces, ankle collar, and swoosh. It really just brings the shoe together and helps it pop. Now I personally will go with the black, but if you guys choose, the shoes also come with red laces if you want to throw a little bit more color on them. Let's go try to find out if it does this shoe some justice. I'm gonna work my way up from bottom to top. So we're gonna try and find some pants real quick. Try not to have too many options, but I'm stuck between those and maybe a black denim. Made my decision. Jordan Craig Distress Denim. Really can never go wrong with these. These are probably my favorite brand jeans. Now I am picking up on a lot of fall winter stuff in the store. So if you guys have not been here recently, you need to come down and the closest kicks USA store. Because you need to get right for winter. Don't want to be out there shivering, turn into a nice popsicle. I mean, there's really only one kind of popsicle. That was that was a stupid comment. There's no other kind of popsicle other than a nice popsicle. Let's check out the Nike and Jordan section. So all these XLs. I'm I'm a I'm a smedium at best. Can I get a can I get a stick thing? The magic wand. I don't know what size it is though. Medium, perfect fit. So here I got the Jordan Mixed Mesh hoodie. I think this is gonna be, this is gonna be flawless. And now that I'm standing right here, I throw this bad boy on my back. Might give a little pop to the sneaker. Let's go ahead and, uh, get that right off the shelf. I was on Ninja Warrior season uh, 13. I grabbed this because it feels like an ice age outside and I'm just not ready for it. I think the materials that I've, I've gathered here today will provide us for an optimal, uh, let's go try it on. All right guys, so I just came out the back and I cannot lie, this is probably my favorite outfit that I put together on Kicks and Fits. I love all black and today I just feel, I feel like nobody can stop me. I'll take the dark night on his best day. Something like that. I went with Jordan Craig jeans, a little bit of distress, nothing too crazy. My kneecaps aren't hanging out, you know, it's still winter time. The mesh up front, a little breathability. I don't know if that's a word, but we're gonna go with it for today. Got the hood on the top, in case I need to cover my head. And this jacket, this is a million dollar jacket. This jacket will keep you warm in the worst night in Antarctica. I love this jacket. Wanna add a little flavor? Throw this bad boy on the back. I think it adds a little splash. I haven't come across a better quality book bag in all my years. All right, so let me know what you guys think, how I did today. I personally think like 15 out of 10, but you guys be the judge of that. Leave us a like or a comment. Be sure to subscribe for more Kicks and Fits episodes. I'll see you guys next time on Kicks and Fits.